Hello and welcome to this AVG video tutorial. This video tutorial will guide you through the process of installing AVG on your computer for the first time using a previously downloaded installation file. First, locate the downloaded AVG installation package on your computer and double click the icon to begin the installation process. The installation files are now being extracted into a temporary folder. Please wait until this process is finished. It may take a few moments. The AVG setup consists of a series of dialog boxes guiding you through the installation process. In the first box, you can select the language you'd like to use for setup. Please select your preferred language and continue by clicking Next. We recommend that you read the license agreement in its entirety. If you understand and accept the license agreement, select the I have read license agreement checkbox and then click the accept button. Clicking don't accept will terminate the installation process. The installation wizard is now checking the system status. On the next screen you can select the installation type standard or custom. We recommend that you use the standard installation However, if you wish to add or remove some components from your AVG during installation, you should select the custom installation. When you're satisfied with your selection, continue by clicking Next. To activate AVG, a license number is required. This AVG license number should be sent to your registered email address within two hours of your payment being processed. These next steps will show you how to copy and paste the AVG license number from the email message to the appropriate field in the activation window. First, launch your email program. In our case, we'll be using Outlook Express. The AVG license number will be included in an email from notification.automat.avg.com. Find the AVG license number in the body of the message. First, highlight the license number. To highlight the license number, click the left mouse button at the beginning of the number, and while holding the button down, slide the cursor over the remainder of the number. Then, release the button. Now, right-click the highlighted license number, and select Copy from the menu. When you have copied the number, return to the installation wizard. Now paste the AVG license number into the appropriate field. To paste the license number, right-click the License Number field and select the Paste option from the menu. Now click Next to continue with the installation. Now confirm the installation of the AVG Security Toolbar or clear this option if you do not wish to install this component. You can find more information about the AVG Security Toolbar in this window. Now click Next to continue. The installation is now in progress. Please allow this process to finish. It may take a few moments. You may notice that a new AVG 9.0 icon will appear in the desktop during the installation process. The next step of the installation is to check for updates. In this step, you can change or adjust the default schedules. By default, the AVG program will automatically check for new updates every 4 hours and an automatic scan will take place every Wednesday at 12 p.m. We recommend that you leave the default values for this time. If needed, you can change these values at any time later. If you are installing a version of AVG that contains firewall protection, the next part of the installation process is the configuration of AVG Firewall. On this screen, you have to select what kind of computer you're using, either a desktop or a portable computer. We have selected the desktop computer option. In this second step, select how your computer is connected to the internet. We have selected the option directly connected via wired or wireless router. 
At this point, the installation is finished and the initial configuration of the AVG program has been created. In this final dialog, you can also decide whether you want to help AVG's research team by allowing your AVG program to report detected threats. All reports are anonymous and no personally identifiable information is collected. Under some conditions, the installation may require a computer restart. If this is the case, click Yes to restart the computer. Please wait until the computer has restarted. After the computer restart, several dialogs based on the installed components may be displayed. The first one is the AVG Optimization Scan dialog. It is recommended to launch this optimization scan immediately. However, it is possible to perform this scan as a part of the first scheduled scan if necessary. This automatically opened web browser window is related to the AVG Security Toolbar and Link Scanner. Here, you can change some basic settings and read some more information about these AVG components. The installation package is no longer needed. You can delete it. Congratulations! The AVG program is now completely installed and configured. You can visit our web pages, download installation files and documentation, check our FAQs, or contact our 24-7 technical support anytime. Thank you for your attention.